Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I am Sab. Welcome to the Sab Fam. In today's video, I think that we have maybe one of the best hauls that I've done. Funny story about this haul is that I basically went away and before I went away, I ordered a bunch of things and I thought that this order just never came. Turns out, it did. And I randomly got all of the items and I was so excited because I actually couldn't remember what I'd chosen at all. So it kind of felt like Christmas. All of the items in the video have been gifted to me. I will link the outfit that I'm wearing down below today. The blazer is from Boohoo. This top's from Bershka. This necklace is from Sylviax. My earrings are from Happiness Boutique. I've got some like of my like own like jewelry that you wouldn't be able to buy and then just a couple of Primark just a couple of Primark rings Ew. okay let's get into it one or two of the items are a little bit more summery just because I've ordered it before but we do have some really cute little bits for awesome winter as well and specifically some jeans and shorts that I'm like obsessed with like so obsessed i tried it on and i was like yes the first thing is this really simple corduroy jacket it's kind of just in like a beige color it's lightweight perfect for autumn and it's just got this kind of like tortoise shell detailing it is a little bit cropped which is the perfect style that i would like for this kind of thing because i feel like it's so easy to just chuck on over a top like kind of similar to the one that i'm wearing today and just with like a nice pair of blue jeans i feel like it's just like a very good like everyday chuck it on with like trainers and going to like do some errands kind of thing really cute absolutely love this i got this one in a medium this next one is actually adorable i'm sorry i've literally just pulled out the other um rope string tire thing by mistake but basically they look like this and this is a little dress this is an adorable dress it kind of has these little grips in the center which i really really like because like i say grips but it's just elasticated double elasticated i like the fact that it's nice and like stretchy and can fit you well this is very very cute i've tried this on with some high shoes and i just really really like the vibe i feel like this with the tan and some like um, like light pink nails, light pink toenails, cold hair, like very like cutesy, like a little like ditzy floral dress, perfect for brunch. Absolutely love this one. Only thing I'm not so mad about is the little cups inside. I would probably be quite inclined to take them out. There's the tire. I feel like you guys have been graced with my terrible singing in a little while. So this top is actually one of the ones that I was slightly more unsure about. Not because of the actual top, just because of the way that it fits. So it's very deep down and the ties are quite low down. So I feel like it's quite difficult to make it, I want to make it tighter to like fit around my boobs. But kind of the way that I've gotten around this is either you wear like a nice bralette underneath that just is completely on show or I wear it over the shoulder which is kind of the way that I prefer to wear it. And I love the little detailed sleeves at the ends. I feel like this is very like, I might be wrong but it's got that like DNG kind of like feel to it. Very like holiday-esque, cute with like a nice pair of like white or cream mom jeans and like a pair of slides i feel like if you still got some like holidays planned this is quite a cute little like evening fit maybe with some little earrings like this and like hair slicked back i feel like that could be quite a cute little fit and i got this little baby in a size medium as well this next dress is stunning i absolutely oh, i say stunning stunning I love it, man. I absolutely love this dress. And I have some matching trousers. The trousers don't go with the dress, but they're in the same print. And I've worn them so much. And they're just one of those items that I have that a lot of people ask me where it's from. And I feel like this might have that same energy. Maybe it won't happen. Maybe no one will ask me. But I just love, so this style of neck is one of my absolute favorites. So it ties at the back and it is like a sleeveless high neck, 
little situation. That is one of my absolute favorite, favorite fits for dress and a top. I really, really like it a lot, and I feel like you never have to wear a bra with it. Not that you have to wear a bra with anything, but I just feel like it's very, like, nice and flowy. It's gripped in this... What is it with me and this gripped word? It's not gripped in the center. It's just elasticated in the center, and I kind of like to... You'll see on the trunk clip, but I like to, like, pull the bottom up a little bit and let the top, like, kind of flip over like that. And then you could pair this with a nice belt. I don't have, I haven't taken all my clothes out of storage yet. That's why I'm going to use that excuse as to why my outfits haven't been like the greatest. But I would kind of pair this with like a nice brown and gray. Am I fine today? Brown and gray belt. Brown and gold belt. Like very cute for a little eve out. I feel like with the wedge would look really adorable. But similarly, if you wanted to wear this in the day with trainers and like a cute little hair i feel like you could get away with wearing such an adorable hairstyle with this i feel like little like pink tails or like little braids or something could just be quite cute i like to wear an up style with a thing like this just because of the tie at the back i feel like it's nice to see the tie i have a few maxi dresses which will be hard to show you on camera so it'll be better stuck on the try on clip but this next one I'm gonna show you is such a winner. I actually ordered it because I already have this dress in white with like pink flowers. I wore it to a wedding in Greece. I'll pop a little picture over here so you guys can see what it looked like on. But I am obsessed with it. It is such a perfect fit and it's really good value for money. So this is the frock, the little young frocklets. And just like tuck them in this is the basic gist of the dress and then it flows all the way down into an open split and it splits like really high up but the way that it sits is covered and then it's got an uber long tie at the back Shoo! really really long and the great thing about this is that it's adaptable so you can basically tie it the way that you want to I will demonstrate the way that I like to wear it, which is a crisscross around the back, around the front, and then tie it again, which I think looks nice and flattering on the back. I love an open back dress. And this is just like, it looks so good on. That's why I ordered the other one, just because I feel like it's such a wedding, like specifically for a wedding, I feel like it's really nice. Okay, last two dresses before we move on to denims. This wasn't my favorite dress. I think it's cute, but I just didn't like the way that it fitted on my boobs. I feel like my boobs are too big for this dress. So it's very like boho style red little dress with a little, again, with the like rouginess, rouged. And then at the back, it's got like a little orange piece and it flows all the way down into like this kind of pattern at the bottom. It's very like wear it to like a cute little picnic is kind of how I imagine it very very like comfortable little dress and like if it's a hot summer's day and you just want to be comfortable but do like you've got like a day's work or you've got stuff that you need to do I feel like this is throw on but looks like you put in more effort than you did the material is actually really nice um I just I'm gonna try and see if I can like change up how it fits but it's more like it kind of it feels like it pushes my boobs in like it's a little bit just too tight and even though the straps are adjustable it's not to do with the straps it's to do with the with the fit of the material you guys will see what i mean this is the last dress and again i think that this one's an absolute banger i just can banger i can just imagine myself wearing this a lot on holiday i imagine it's like a really good one for bali let me show you the dress before i keep going on it is the perfect beach dress. I love this kind of like tie neck. It's got the same neck situation as the last dress with the long ties, slightly less long actually. And then it's just got this kind of like open boob, nice like stretchy open back. And then it also flows down long to the bottom and has got like an open leg split. I just feel like this is such a flattering style and I definitely know that I'm going to get wear out of this dress. I feel like it's so versatile, like 
pop it onto the beach for like a fairly more chill day slap on some big shades and like don't make eye contact with anyone and similarly you could dress it up with some nice like high gold heels or something cute little bag and like wear this to a wedding or to like a fancy event and it would still look really good and sophisticated I honestly love this so much like if you don't know what to wear to a wedding and you don't want to spend a lot of money I seriously would recommend looking on Zapple they've just got some really really good maxi dresses because I'm hot oh, my hair keeps getting stuck my hair gets stuck and I'm just a little bit like it's one of those days where it, it's like been about to rain for the whole day so far it's like about to piss it down it's like lingering and it's just not a good climate for like hair and for like sweating and stuff i feel like freaking sticky it is hot okay maybe the sweat's coming from the excitement of one of my favorite freaking items that i got i'm obsessed obsessed with this now i usually get pretty scared of ordering denims online from a brand that I've never tried before especially if it's not like a brand where I feel like I can easily exchange it but so far I've had such a good run with denims like I feel like their sizing is actually pretty good so I have this high-waisted pair of denim shorts just with like a completely plain black black completely plain back I love these I'm obsessed with these I just really like them because I feel like they're number one a really nice denim color two they fit nicely and three I love the like double pocket detail and if you're wondering yes both of the pocket situations are actual pockets we can all appreciate that and I quite like that it's smooth on the butt you know most of my jeans I'm not sure if I have jeans most of my like denim shorts like this have pockets on the back and I feel like it's quite nice so this is like toy to the butt make you like have like a perky little bubble butt these are adorable i really really like them so much a lot of these items don't actually have the size on it but i will try and look everything down below and i'm pretty sure that i got these in a medium okay moving on to actual jeans and i feel like these are the items that i'm going to get asked the most about where they're from especially when i'm wearing them so this first pair is a pair of spliced denims Spliced, I'm freaking I'm fashionable. Got a good lingo. I can't I can't want the zips not being like done up. I have to present the items when they're done up. Okay. So this is the pair of jeans. It is literally spliced all the way down. Sliced black and blue, black and blue, high-waisted, same at the back as it is at the front. These just fit like a little dream. Again, they don't have a size on them, but I'll link it down below. I actually was inspired to get these because I saw like a similar style of jeans on Luana, who is um, someone that I've been following since the days of Lookbook. If you guys remember Lookbook, comment a book in the emojis in the comment section if you remember that. That's where I originally know her from and I'm obsessed with her style. It's very like moody and grungy. I really, really like it. And she has some jeans like this and I really like the way that she styled it up. And I really like these. I just feel like they're just something quite different. I own a lot of jeans and this is not something that I own. So welcome to the collection. These jeans are very youthful of me. These jeans are screaming 90s baby and they also scream that I'm trying not to turn 30 which would be accurate in itself. So I'm holding on to my youth with these. Does it look like maybe I printed on the butterflies with a stencil myself? Perhaps. Am I mad about it? No. These are fun. <laughs> look at freaking this. Butterfly jeans my lads butterfly jeans the butterflies are only on the front but i'm not mad about it i feel like six butterflies per leg might be pushing it a bit insect heavy for my liking <gasps> but these are so freaking adorable 
I feel like I would definitely style it up with something like this. This is a crop top, by the way. I would definitely style it up with something like this, like very like basic on the top. I wouldn't be busting out with like a leopard print shirt and this. I feel like the butterflies are bold enough and speak for themselves. But these are nice. The quality of the denim is nice. They're high waisted again and like kind of. I want to say they're straight legged. Straight leg jeans, high waisted. I'm quite bad at knowing the difference between like mom jeans, boyfriend jeans, dad jeans. They're all just like super baggy jeans to me, unless the leg flare is the near flare leg. Or. I'm struggling. I'm struggling. I don't have any other suggestions. Why did I try this baggy leg jean with butterfly? I honestly, that's what they should call it baggy leg jean with butterfly. Simple, to the point. High waisted in brackets. <gasps> Love these so, so much. Hope you guys love them too. And I really hope that they still have these in stock. Okay, I have two co-ords for you guys. And these are two things that I absolutely love. The last one, I'm saving best for last, is like my favorite co-ord because I just know I'm going to wear the actual shit out of it. But this is a, another one that's adorable for one of those warmer days. For the beach. For vacation. Mm. I'm obsessed. So this is the shirt, it's a linen, like white linen shirt, it has got long sleeves but you can do them up like this with a little like, what do you call this guy? It's just basically so that you can do the button up and it like lives, in, lives inside the shirt, oh my god I'm super weird, lives inside up the army and this is just a very nice and lightweight so i feel like it's stylish and comfortable which is my winning combination and then it comes with the true winner in my opinion which is this pair of white shorts also in this exact like match linen material and i feel like i just don't own anything like this at the moment and it's just perfect beach wear so comfortable like you're not going to feel like there's actual sand in your vagina when you put this on do you know when you put denim shorts on after the beach and it feels like you're being accosted by sand and like all of the ocean buzz this pair of shorts is not gonna get ocean buzz up your so that's one reason to love it it would be leveled up to like such a level i'm going to the level it would be leveled up to such a level if it had pockets every pair of shorts is better with pockets. Fight me. Who doesn't want to pop their hand in to a little pose? Who doesn't want to keep their shit in their pocket? Who doesn't want to sometimes rest in their pocket when they're tired? Pockets would have done it justice, but that's all right. We're not going to be too mad. They're still like a solid eight out of 10. Really, really like these. Mmm, like it a lot. And I also like the fact that you don't have to be at the beach or on the holiday, on the holiday, on a holiday to wear these. You can actually just wear this up for like a nice little, like I don't know why I can describe these like nice little days. That are, who's going on these nice little days that I'm always talking about? But I feel like you know what I mean. Like if you're going for like, you, it's not bougie, but it's like a lunch where you want to be like cute, sophisticated, but you don't want to try too hard. Like it's that lunch. Like it's a cool little like, it's a pit stop, but you're not at the McD's. Do you know what I mean? Who sits down in the McDonald's anyway, unless you're like really drunk? throws it right back to the last time I was sat in the McDonald's and shouted at the hot guy that came through the door. Oh my gosh. And complained about the sauce not being good enough. But that is not a story for this video. <gasps> I feel like I need to do like drunken like nights out stories or like things that have happened when you stop for food or things that happen after the night out. <laughs> That's actually a good video but I'd have to brainstorm and then I'd get like really scared about the choices that I made and probably spiral. Okay, the last items are not a code. They're a three-piece set, okay, leveling up to another level of matchness. And I am obsessed, especially because I like every piece in the set. Every piece fits me really nicely, and it's just something that I know I'm going to chuck on and live in often. So, it is this little color. Perfect for autumn and adaptable for like summer as well. I, I like the fact you can wear all of the items separately <gasps> Okay, so this pair of Bottoms, it's in a medium. It's got a drawstring nice thick really good quality waist real pockets yo yo cuffed bottoms like actually just a perfect 
perfect pair of bottoms. I don't know how to describe it as well because it's like stretchy, but the material is still soft. It's not like tracksuit material, so it's actually that little bit labeled up in terms of like fanciness, like what it would look like on. I'm actually obsessed with these. I have a similar like color and style of um, pants from trousers for the British people, in case they think my underwear are like this. Uh, trousers from Zappo that I wear all the time. So when I got these and saw that they were similar, I was so stoked about that. And then it gets paired with this little crop top, which also is damn adorable. I've already tried this on with a different outfit and it was so cute. It even could go with this outfit that I have on today. I love this. I actually would want to order quite a few more of these in like different colors. Ow. Something attacked me. This, this little wooden chair has like these little wooden spikes that get you every now and then. But rude. <gasps> then the matching freaking hooded top to that bad boy which again is adorable the only thing that I was surprised by and I don't hate the only thing I was surprised by is that it didn't have like drawstrings so it just kind of ends it doesn't need them because I nearly try to put the hood on like this can we take a moment I wanted to put the hood on to demonstrate that it doesn't need the little ties. But I just like visually, I kind of expected them to be there and they weren't. Um, but the, the material of this is really nice and comfortable and stretchy. And it just fits like really cute. I'll show you how I would style it um, when I'm wearing it. But I would like probably keep it open. I like that like chilled loose fit. I feel like when you like do it all up, maybe it's a little bit too much of like elasticatedness in the center. I like the like laxed kind of outfit and honestly 100% something that I would just chuck on and go and like run some errands in that is like the ish or if you're just chilling at home like if I'm editing my videos and stuff if I'm not wearing my actual pajamas and I want to feel like I've still kind of got my day together and I haven't just been lounging in my PJs like the entire day in sleepwear then I put on something like this that feels like put together but secretly it's as comfortable as pajamas so my beautifuls, that was everything that I got. I hope that I can link as many of the items as possible down below for you guys. If I can't find the exact item, I will link an alternative for you. Until next time, I love you guys so, so much. I think that the next video I might see you in is a Halloween video. I've got a Halloween outfits video coming. I've ordered a bunch of things from Dolls Kill. I'm so, so excited to show you guys. And I'm also going to have some Halloween like makeup looks coming. So keep your eyes peeled. If you did enjoy the video, do subscribe and join the little sub fam. And let me know what else you want to see in the comments down below. Love you guys so much. Bye.